amazing, amazing music from right here on Art and Culture Monday. What a way, what a way to open up our second hour. And we are glad to be here. We are glad to be listening to such beautiful music. And that tells you that I'm not alone in studio. I'm joined by a beautiful girl with a beautiful voice. And you want to get to know her, to get to know what she does. Um, and exactly, you know, how she came about such beautiful music. Uh, and of course, where her partner is because they were supposed to be a duo. So good morning. How are you? Good morning. How are you? I'm good. I am doing fantastic. How is your Monday morning? My Monday morning is fine. How mm-hmm. about yours? Mine is good mm-hmm. as well. Are you, are you a morning person? No, no. Yeah? You, yeah. Are, you have really worked hard to yeah, be here yeah, this yeah, morning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> No, no worry. You and uh, you and I both. You and I both. I mm-hmm. want you to say hi to mm-hmm. our audience who are watching from home, mm-hmm. and uh, just tell us who you are, mm-hmm. the name of your band, of course, before we jump right in. Hi guys, my name is Margaret. Yes. Um, I sing with a band called We Are Nubia. We're the two of us. Mm-hmm. I'm supposed to be with my partner here, but she's she's unfortunately right now in a court session, so mm-hmm. I had to proceed alone ah, to show yeah. up for you and her yeah. <laughs> yeah well it's okay you are here you are here so mm-hmm. we are going to be having an a fantastic t- a fantastic time just as we would have mm-hmm. if she was here um so let's start from the very beginning and just yeah. to get to know when your music journey started mm-hmm. yes um for the both of us it started way back in church mm-hmm. before we grew into music very well mm-hmm. Both of us participated in our different schools in the music and I was in drama festival, Mm -hmm. she was in music festival, Mm -hmm. but we came and met in a choir in Nairobi, which we later formed a band. Mm -hmm. And yeah, we started on the June 22nd, 2021. Mm -hmm. Mm So we are about two years old. Ah, this yeah, month. This exactly. Month. So in yeah. a few days, you yeah. are going to be two years old. Yeah. That, that is that is quite specific. I mm-hmm. like that. Like you know the day that you yeah. decided yeah. to to do this as a duo. Yeah. So um, what um inspired you to do this together? Uh huh. We 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 came from that choir mm-hmm. and we had uh, we had a culture of going to practice mm-hmm. every time so we we're like we can't stay like this like we need to do something because it's something that we are very used to yes yeah so mm-hmm. we formed a band yeah and we started like uh, by it was not that serious mm-hmm. so we formed an Instagram and we started posting videos mm-hmm. the first video really did well we didn't even expect it yes and the song was i remember the song was by ben soul yes we even had ben soul commenting so it was a wow it was a big moment yeah it was a big moment for us Mm -hmm. and that's how we grew our audience yes through covers yes to now singing our own songs. To singing your own music. Yeah. Wow, I, I like that because mm-hmm. I was about to ask about people's reception of the covers that you were doing. Mm-hmm. But before we get there, mm-hmm. the name We Are Nubia, mm-hmm. where, like, what inspired that? What does it mean? Mm-hmm. Yeah. We were looking for a name because mm-hmm. we just can't, like, um, yes. we were many. We, we were actually five. Yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So we, we Nubia means gold. Mm hmm. So we decided to be called We Are Gold. Yes, We and Are Gold. Ah, yeah, okay, yeah. fantastic name yeah. choice. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, that, that, that is amazing. And mm-hmm. if you hear their voices, if you hear Margaret's voice, you can tell that for sure <laughs> they are gold. Yeah. So um, uh, people's reception of you guys doing covers was quite fantastic. Quite, quite, quite. Good. Yeah. Which, which cover did you enjoy the most? Can we hear like an a cappella of a cover that you actually liked? Uh huh. I'll sing a cover that really put out, like that really opened, like mm-hmm. us knowing yes people in the industry. Yeah, and that was my jaber. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Ah, uh, could you like can we hear a snippet of an yeah. acapella? Yeah. Okay. My jaber, una meta meta, uta kunywa nini wallet ni meleta. Anyako yo teke imeweza ukisuka chini unatetemesa ah 
beautiful beautiful voice i told you i told you guys and you you guys one have amazing voices mm -hmm. can, can you um okay of course i know there is talent mm -hmm. but can you also give credit to that you are in a choir and practice mm -hmm. and all the practice sessions you have been to ama exactly how did your voice get that good i started way back in class four yeah at, I was singing in church at Sitam Valley Road. Yes. So my mom would take me to the podium to yes. sing for people. Yes. That's how I grew. Mm -hmm. My friend also used to sing in church, mm -hmm. in the Catholic choir. Yeah. So that's how we grew. Yeah. Between. Yeah. Vocals mm -hmm. and 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 to have such beautiful, yeah, amazing yeah. voices. You do really sing beautifully. Mm -hmm. We are we are excited to get to your own project to see what it is that you're capable of just doing with those amazing voices. Mm -hmm. Um. So um. June twenty sixth, twenty second. This mm -hmm. journey began. How mm -hmm. have the last two years been? Mm, it has been full of ups and downs. Mm -hmm. As I told you, we were five prior. Yes. And we were basically a girl group. Yes. And that that does not limit us from go undergoing dynamics yes. of a girl band. Yes. That explains why we are two now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We've learned a lot, uh -huh. especially for us. We we really blew up with the second post we posted. Yes. So we were exposed to the high high end mm -hmm. world mm -hmm. before we had gone through our crawling process yes so now we went through the, our high end world then yes. now we came back to the to crawling process exactly so it was it was not quite easy because mm -hmm. we were used to a certain uh, some type of life yeah uh -huh. so we had to now come down and we're like wow are we really at this point right now? Yeah. But now we had to go through that crawling process mm -hmm. and no details now about music. Well, yeah. and I can say it's a beautiful journey. Uh, some I love uh, what just Ivy says. She mm -hmm. says, "Love your hustle, like love what you go through while, while you're still trying to get there. Love your sweat. Yeah. Yeah, because it makes you know, become knowledgeable about things." And I love it that two years from, if I look back two years then, yes. I'm now knowledgeable in the music industry yeah. than I was. So I'm grateful for the crawling process. For the crawling process. Yeah. Well, it has moved you from five members to a uh, uh, two, two. Uh, member, ba mem member band. Yeah. And uh, I'm loving that um, despite, you know, all those challenges, mm -hmm. you can kind of see an upward kind of growth because yeah. you're headed into a new EP. Yeah. Who knew? Like, yeah. you know, some people that that crawling process would have left probably the five of you not even together. So yeah. the fact that there's still a band and yeah. not just a band, but a band is that is doing great every day mm -hmm. is something to be very proud about For so sure. at what point did you move from um harvest to now thinking okay we need to do our own music we need to write our own thing mm -hmm. now the first song we did yeah was 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 steered by jealous yes we went to, we were singing uh, for a certain corporate mm -hmm. function. Yeah. And we met with Jalango mm -hmm. and he was like, you girls, how, how, how long have you been singing Together. covers? Yeah. And we were like, quiet for some time. And he was like, uh, why haven't you gone to the studio and produced a song? And we were like, we're still waiting to find yeah. our own niche. Was, he was like, no girls, you yeah. need to go to the studio. And he, he gave us a time limit of like two weeks mm -hmm. to come up with a song. So that's how the first song came about. Yes. Yeah. Wow. And how uh, was people's reception towards now your own created music? Uh, they, were, they, were, they were good. They were quite good. Uh -huh. Yeah, they were fair. Yes, amazing. Mm -hmm. I want us mm -hmm. to listen to the next song before now we come to the um to you guys, your mm -hmm. own music and your EP mm -hmm. and everything that now has to do with your own music. Mm -hmm. But right about now you want to listen to the second song. Which mm -hmm. one will it be and what it is is it about? Um it will be Usiku Namchana. Yes. Uh, it's a love song uh -huh. uh, where a girl is is like simping for the guy yeah yeah ah okay yeah so right about now margaret from the nubia music band mm -hmm. um with um usiku namchana
one usiku na mchana from we are nubia music band and margaret is here to represent the band and we're having an amazing time again you guys have amazing amazing voices question how many times do you meet for practice Mm. Um, it is dependent on a project that you are working on. Um, is it, you know, a general, like every week we meet or every month we meet? We meet like twice in a week. Mm -hmm. And also the days can increase yeah. dependent on the project you are working on. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, so tw yeah. twice twice a week yes so yeah. twice a week that 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 is good like mm -hmm. you can tell the the vocals have been to practice mm -hmm. somewhere yeah. and how how important because you know too, there are people that are watching and uh, they are aspiring uh, band members mm -hmm. or they would even like to join um we are nubia mm -hmm. how important is practice to vocals hmm, practice mm -hmm. Practice is very important to vocals because singing is a muscle yeah. that needs to be trained. Uh -huh. So when it's just like working out, if you back out from working out, mm -hmm. you will go back to where you used to be. Yes. So it's a muscle that needs to be rehearsed mm -hmm. and memorized. And memorized over yeah. and over, over. and over. Yeah. Wow, yeah. amazing. So yeah, if you are about to get into the music industry or you're already there, you are learning the ropes. Probably this is some of the information that you need, so that mm -hmm. your crawling process is a bit easier. Yeah, you know. Yeah. And so I hope and that also you guys. it increases your your bonding time, uh -huh. getting to know each other well. Yes, true. And chemistry. Yes. Yeah. And good chemistry results to good music and like performance. And performances. Yeah. Wow, I hope that you guys from home are learning a thing or two about uh, being in a band or just doing music really really well um so let's move on so um jalas inspired your first song or rather pushed for your first song mm -hmm. and then from there where did we go to we went to a song called niwewe now we are going to studio now mm -hmm. to yes to feature our next song mm -hmm. by that time we were now too mm -hmm. yeah so we sang niwewe and mm -hmm. released that single yes yeah how did it do now that you are just um now we are two band members mm -hmm. so how did that song do the song did well mm -hmm. it's uh, the audience did not the audience was still the same mm -hmm. yeah despite us being two yes yeah. so you you feel like and then from uh Niwewe, you moved on to the ep the yeah yeah now we are done with the ep mm -hmm. Uh, it might be out there about in July. In July. Yeah. So let's talk about the EP. Mm -hmm. What inspired the EP? You know, you have just moved from covers to a few singles. Mm -hmm. um, what brought about the idea of, well, you, we need to put an EP together? Mm -hmm. We were really trying to find a sound. Mm -hmm. Because right now we are very versatile. Even in that EP, it's yeah. very versatile. We're trying out new styles so mm -hmm. that we can settle on a niche mm -hmm. that is going to identify us as Nubia. Yeah. And also, we want to increase our creating mm -hmm. game. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that also inspired our EP. Uh -huh. And also, our EP was inspired by love. Mm -hmm. We're writing for the lovers out here. Yes. And the people who love parting, mm -hmm. so some good music is on the way. Is on the way for sure. How many? Yes, how many songs are in the? EP? There are five of there them. There are five songs. Yeah. So that, that's a that's a good record. That's yeah. a good number of songs. Yeah. Um, how long did it take for you guys to put that together? Mm hmm. Two months, mm -hmm. yeah. About two months. Yeah. Did this mean like are there songs that you had written prior? Mm -hmm. Am I you? All these songs in the EP were freshly written. Freshly written in the studio. In, yes, in yeah. about two months. That's yeah. that's record time. That's yeah. good time to yeah. be able to put an EP together, shoot them, um, have the audio recorded. Mm -hmm. Are there videos? Have you shot the videos? Not, not yet. yet. Uh -huh. Yes, but you have heard. Um, who writes your music? Do you both write? Music? You both write. You we both write. write. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah, and also in this EP, our we co-writeed with our producer mm -hmm. called Petrus. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so you guys are working as solo artist, Ama and any We are label. working purely as solo artist. As solo artist, how yeah. do you like it that way? Um, I love, I love that for for us now because it gives us room for learning. Mm -hmm. Because I feel like. Uh, I think under a label there will be so much information that we miss out on mm -hmm. getting to a label right now. So I feel like 
uh, being solo artist gives yes. us room for learning yes. and learning things and also making us grow as people and being assertive in what we stand for and what we deserve. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, and we love that for you, the fact that you keep learning and you're willing to take up the whole process. Yeah. You know, if you are doing this, let's do this yeah. fully. Mm -hmm. um, take me through your creative process. Mm -hmm. Say you have an idea of mm -hmm. a song. How mm -hmm. does that go from a song mm -hmm. to, you know, uh, from an idea in your head mm -hmm. to a song that is out for people to listen in? Uh, for us, mm -hmm. we come up with our topic we want to write on. Mm -hmm. Uh, so when you find a topic, it's just like Insha, when you find a topic, yes. you start explaining mm -hmm. and use the simplest yet so poetic of words yes. to expl to write mm -hmm. and uh, words that people will relate. Yes. Uh, what else? We try to use rhyme skill. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then from there, the beat is laid we lay voices we lay the beat yeah and then from that uh, uh being mixed and mastered by the producer yes yeah and then it's it's ready to yeah. you know to go out there mm -hmm. um you have shot a few videos mm -hmm. especially of your um single songs mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. how was that experience and who did you work with we worked with someone called moha mm -hmm. a videographer called moha mm -hmm. Um, that experience was not so easy, mm -hmm. but yet so worth it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What we, what made it not so easy? We had booked a, a house for shooting the yes the, the video the video. Uh -huh. Kumbe the person had conned us. Yeah. So the last day to the shoot, like yeah. on, in the in the evening, we called him and like oh, oh, we need to see the house. He was like. I don't really know where the house is. Oh my god. What? My so now you have dropped. no shoot location. Yeah. yeah. University yeah. of life. Eh? Yeah. So we had to look for a location that night at around nine nine eight nine PM. Yes. Yeah, we went town looking for still looking for a location. Yes. Yeah. Oof. That 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 was must have been quite the hassle. Yeah. I can imagine this is something you have been planning for months, mm -hmm. uh, and now you have to do it in a matter of hours. Mm -hmm. But you did manage. Yeah, we did. How manage. how did the new location turn out to be? It, it was good. It was good. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. And then that seems like it it all um you know came together um yeah, pretty did. well. We but hey um. Con, uh, we, are, we, are we even going to call them con men? How many con women? How many con people? They that, did us that. Hey, yeah. that. That was one dirty one. Mm -hmm. Were you able, like, had you made payment and were you yeah, able we to had, recover? Am I no, just no, left we that didn't slide? recover the money. We yeah. had made a deposit. Well, if they are watching, shame on them. Mm -hmm. And every other <laughs> con artist out there, it's already hard enough to make mm -hmm. music. Mm -hmm. Now, if yeah. you um, bring on conmanship, uh, it's it's just pretty hard yeah. and uh, but you did bounce from that yeah, and i hope did. that you learned now yeah. you're not doing bookings without having yeah, seen site the venue. visit yes yeah. and a site yeah. visit yeah. again i hope that artists are learning from mm -hmm. this especially if you're just fresh into the industry yeah. pick up pick up some of these lessons so that you don't have to go through the rabbit holes that um the newbie had to go through mm -hmm. probably for not knowing okay mm -hmm. yes okay so let's move on um what um when is the ep going to be released uh, July, we don't have a certain date yet, mm -hmm. but in the month of July. But in the month of July, yeah. well, we are going to look out for that one. Please so, do. in the month of July, already to conform, the yeah. Nubia is um, releasing. We are Nubia is releasing their first EP, yeah. and you have heard the voices. I don't think yeah. I can sell this anymore. Yeah. Yes, you're going to be getting now five songs with such amazing uh, voices. The mm -hmm. mix and match, uh, the mixing is done pretty um, fantastically. Yeah. So, you are looking forward to that one. Mm -hmm. Are you guys um, considering any collaborations? For sure. Yes. Well, we have done one with our producer. Yeah. Um, for sure, we are considering collabs after we have released our own. Your own EP. Now we go yes. to we can go to collab. To collab. Okay. Yeah. So that would bring me to um, what is the dream for We Are Nubia? What is the what is the the dream that you saw before all this, the journey began, what do you want? Uh, what does the future look like for there you guys? There are very few girl bands in the country. Yes, that is true. Very few. Yeah. So we want to inspire 
the girls out here that mm. we can also make it yes and be and leave a mark yes and yeah we also want to surpass the local market mm -hmm. and go internationally yeah that's on good yes uh, also we want to be stars yes yeah <laughs> i mean simply put mm -hmm. yes i do hope and pray that you achieve all of your dreams and yeah. that the future will look brighter and brighter For and sure. if the past is any indication you guys are on the right path so yeah. we can only watch we can only vouch for you mm -hmm. um where can we find your music and uh, social media handles you can find our music on youtube yes. on spotify on boomplay yes. um uh, on Apple, mm -hmm. you can also our social media handles. Sorry, yes. our social media handles are Instagram uh, underscore we dot r mm -hmm. dot, dot nubia underscore. Mm -hmm. uh, also on YouTube, uh, we are nubia. TikTok, yes. we are nubia. Yes. Yeah. And your personal social media handles? My personal social media handle is underscore dot atino dot underscore, mm -hmm. and my friends is dot. Uh, Monga mm -hmm. dot Gloria dot Gloria. There's yeah. a lot of dot and underscores. <laughs> you should just look for. Yeah. We are Nubia, and that one mm -hmm. can direct you to every uh, yeah. other platform yeah. that they will be on. Well, we are looking forward to the release of the EP. Mm -hmm. We are excited for it. We cannot wait for for it to be released. Mm -hmm. And if anything, your songs are just amazing. So mm -hmm. we are looking forward. Mm -hmm. Yes, and next month would be a good time for your partner to be here. So Muneza Rudi, Rudi ni hapa. Let's feel the duo sure. exactly. Mm -hmm. then, and come and launch that um, EP here. Mm -hmm. We would be um, we would be honored to have you guys here because Thank you're you. doing amazing work. Um, please big up your team before we go to the last performance. Uh -huh. Yes, both your fans, fan mm -hmm. base. I know there are people that are supporting you, that are family, friends, and also <coughs> your fans. Mm -hmm. uh, I'd first start like to big up our family. They really take a big role in supporting us. Yes. Uh, our friends who hold us down, who share our music, our content, uh, and our fan base that is so true. Yeah. Uh, who are always there to share our music, comment. We really do appreciate that. We do not take that for granted. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, thank you very much for being here. It's mm -hmm. been an honor and a pleasure, and the music is amazing. I know you guys at home are watching and enjoying. Mm -hmm. We want to wrap up this lounge with the last performance, which is an a cappella, which I think is a beautiful way to hear your voice. Mm -hmm. And so, uh, ladies and gentlemen, right about now, Margaret from We Are Nubia Music Band with the last performance as an a cappella. Mm -hmm. I will sing one song from the EP we did yesterday at the church sessions. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Local, local, see as in mind to get you local, 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 see as in mind to get you local. Why lie? Your search of vibe. I just wanna make you mine. Local, yeah. local. See as in mine to get you local. Thank you.